big hands. Well, you've got, you got at least I half of your... You do? Yes. Yeah. You just, 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 just... Everyone except... Oh, you know I thought it was you, too. No, 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 no. no. It is... I'm a half-orc, half-mountain dwarf. Of course I got my vision. Victor has Victor has Oh. Uh, All right, everybody. Uh, yes. Welcome to this session of Intelligence. Check us out. I'm Adam, and I'm the DN for the session. And we are going to just reintroduce the players for this campaign. So... Kenny, I'm the paladin slash healer for now. I'm Dylan. I'm the fighter wizard. Noah. I'm Zred D the monk. Derek. The wild magic sorcerer. And currently, we do not have Damien, who is our uh, saber, our rogue tabaxi. I miss my poop too. But but he will be he will be here um, hopefully next session, if not next, uh, the one after. So. By this episode, episode two of the campaign, you guys have just discovered the way down into the castle following the band of skeletons. And you guys have a little bit of fun trying to follow them. That went well, that went oh, oh. so well. And I believe oh, that led to Minimus's second? Second death. Second death? Second death. Second death. Followed oh, by It me. was the second death. It was the second death. Uh, the, the first time she died... Was mentally. Was mentally, yeah. So, <laughs> it was her PTSD moment. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> sent her to go investigate something. Yes. Uh, we won't talk about that. We're she she died on the inside, <laughs> now she died on the outside. Um, I love but yeah, you, you, you refought some previous skeletons, and they just reanimate over time. What do you mean refought? It was literally just... Farming over and over and getting nothing out of it except for pain and anguish. Couldn't even take the items because they turned into sludge and everything else. Yeah, but that's oh, what so happens when life. this place is magically succumbed to the void. Yeah. Uh, and then, and then you met the probably your most, I don't know, advantageous, not ally, but um, friend, acquaintance. Acquaintance. Yeah, let's go. Acquaintance. Acquaintance. Rathmore, the Death Knight. Glad it went the way it went because it could have went real sideways because of you. I still blame that on you guys for just standing outside an open door talking about how we're gonna attack it. And guys, we're talking a lot. We were just basically plotting how are we gonna kill it? And it was just like, I'm just gonna do it. It was in moving. <laughs> yeah, we could have walked in and be like, hey. That hey, was never on the plane. You guys are very Everything else in that castle That's starts we slow, didn't, we didn't was even very slow. We didn't talk about anything. Before we even discussed, you just went, no, magic missile! Not before we discussed, it was about five minutes into discussing. You, you, you did talk for equivalently of like two to three minutes, but it wasn't reacting, so nothing was, like, nothing was happening in the room. It was yeah. just dead skeletons and a pile of armor that was laying on a floor. I mean, as far as we knew, the skeletons had sacrificed themselves to make the Death Knight. Yes. Yeah. Every, everything we've seen so far led me to believe it was an enemy. But he turned but out to be pretty cool, though. He, he introduced himself very... Uh, annoyed? No, he, it, he, he, he was, was annoyed, but he, he was more or less like, you, you scuffed up my armor, like, why? Uh, I was just taking a nap on this throne, what the hell, dude? He was. He, he took out some skeletons, he was taking a little nap. Uh, Death, Knights, Death Knights tend to need to relax because they're pseudo-immortal. Yeah. Uh, but then he did help you get past that void wall, because did anyone uh, did any one of you wanted to take partake in that? No. Somebody no. would have had to in order I mean, to get past I that. probably would have, because at the time I, mean, I had... would have been more than that. No, at the time, I had about 65, 67 health. It would have been me, but the fact that you I was, had, the, I I was, I was the only you in the room. Exactly, which is why I, I really don't think you guys are thinking about this. Dreadkey would have wanted more than any of you to be the one to hold the fight. He is self-flagellation. We so had this the health pool to do it. It's, it's not, it's not it's exactly the health pool. pool. Just I would have just handed you a You would have had to probably make concentration checks. Then it would have been me. Because you would have had to be able to concentrate on literal darkness being torn into your body. I see. If you if you remembered after after the next part that we're going to talk about, his hand was pseudo laced with it. Yes. The last time you saw him, yeah. it he is powerful, but it did not unaffect him. Yeah. And yeah, granted, since I'm a paladin and divine energy, I I still would have been pseudo kind of screwed over with that. You should have gone in. I would have stayed. 
Anyhow, that's, that's all said and done. The, I think that pseudo boss fight was interesting the, and the boss annoying. Fight. Well, it, it, it just, that, that was essentially the boss fight of that area. The lizard warlock was definitely nothing to scuff at, because this is the first intelligent fight you guys had. You, you fought an assassin that threw books at you, but you circumvent the books, and... Took a spectral dagger to the You chest. guys were level one. I wasn't going to throw freaking... I'll think. Sorry, level two. <laughs> I wasn't going to throw Albert Einstein at you. And then the the uh, bullet fight. The bullet was essentially just a giant monster that wanted to eat things. This was the first one who could speak your language and understand tactics. So when a monk decided, hmm, I'm going to try and get up to him. Well, that's a fake door. Okay, I'm going to climb. That's me falling off. All right, I'm going to go, and I'm gone. I forgot Magic. you. Magic! I forgot you fell off. That, yeah, that, that was hilarious. Fell Breaking off El twice. Breaking Eldritch push. No, he, he got pushed off once. He climbed it twice. Yes, I <laughs> um, Because I'm a monk, and I can do that. Those, those were just... My downfall is, when you put us in such huge rooms, literally everybody likes to spread out. I am yes. caught yes. running. Hey, trying to, I, oh shit, you're down. Heal. Hey, oh, you're I down. I try Heal. to stay as close to you as I can because I know that you're the tank in the party. I, I know, but everybody likes to spread out, and I'm like, I can only heal so and much. And there's one hey. thing that happens when you're close together. Yeah. Wild magic. <laughs> oh, hey, that works. Okay, of let's, go, let's go back a step. <laughs> right. While they were all clumped together, I was hasted, and I was basically one on one a shield guardian because I thought. There's four of them over there. Our, most of our team is right there. They can handle the other one. I'm boosted right now. I can solo this guy. I turn around, everyone's gone. <laughs> See, what happened before that was that it was my turn, and I cast a spell which made me do a wild magic roll. I succeed that magic roll, and what Adam ended up rolling for percentage was me making myself invisible, as well as anyone within a 30-foot radius of me turning invisible as well, which happened to be... Uh, Damien with the rogue, uh, Kenny with the paladin, as well as one of the shield guardians, which yep. before we even realized it was now covered in the coagulated void. In, in the meantime, I tried to go f go directly for the big magical threat who whisked me away without a thought. So yep. I was alone yeah, in the room. <laughs> Essentially, you were fighting alone. a shield golem. Staring at a lizard, it was wondering where my team was. Well, 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 he was half lizard, like literally half void. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He was, he yeah. was covered a, in void. A few seconds in game, asshole. out of game, probably five, ten minutes before people started appearing. Mm -hmm. Saber appeared really fast. Yeah, because Saber, as yeah. soon as that happened, but ran directly to the other It was corner. a good, like, I think two rounds before everyone else started to reappear. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but, but uh, it, it quickly it quickly went to just a war of attrition with those two guys, because besides your one lightning bolt, yeah. nobody really... Damien did do I a few shots. The lightning bolt went straight for the lizard, mm -hmm. the, but it, which was the end of the fight. Yeah, and then, after, at the end of the fight was when the lizard kind of, he just vanished and disappeared and things started and crumbling. And then, so then he just left his things for us while the castle started falling so apart. Our, yeah, so we just grabbed the crystal while we just... We grabbed the fucking crystal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you out. are like, bastard out. Wait, wait, we we'll talk about we, that we, next we one. We yeah, all that. Yeah, yeah. Describe it that much. You yeah, got the question in general. And then ended up escaping the castle and noticing that there was a beautiful blue sky outside. <laughs> and See you next time. Bye. 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 B